Wheezy? Is that you? Hey, Woody. Oh no, oh no, I think I swallowed my squeaker. What's the point in prolonging the inevitable? Bye, Woody. There, there you go, pal. Bless you, Woody. <laughs> it's Wheezy. <laughs> she just told him that to calm him down and then put me on the shelf. <laughs> Well, why didn't you yell for help? Well, I tried squeaking, but I'm still broken. No one could hear me. <laughs> We're all just one stitch away from here to there. Woody, I'm slipping. <laughs> you just gotta save my pal Woody. I think I feel a song coming on. You're watching Today I Grew Up. Hey partners, most of my views come from non-subscribers, so please consider subscribing today. Hit that alert so you'll be notified for future videos. It helps me as I'm on my way to 100,000 subs this year. Really appreciate it. So I want to start with the box. Um, this box is really nice because it feels like I went to Elle's Toy Barn to buy this and even has the logo of Elle's Toy Barn. It says everything for a buck, 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 a wheezy, squeaky penguin bath toy. Squeeze him, he squeaks, not for use in water. And here's a side view. It says squeaky penguin, do not immerse in water. To replace damaged squeaker, please contact one of our authorized repair centers in the Tri-County area. It's cool. It even has a QRC code, which is cool. Everything for a buck, 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 made in China. Al's Toy Barn. And then the back is also repeating. Um, squeaky Penguin Bath Toy, not for use in water again. That's cool. And then the bottom's just yellow. And the top, I like that it has the new logo, so it feels like brand new. It's a brand new toy. Squeaky Penguin Bath Toy. And if you open the, the lid, um, that's where it was packaged really well in here and even has like an extra cardboard in there to keep the box. Um, from collapsing in on itself. So COP did a great job packaging this so that it survived sh in shipping. And this box is flawless and I really love it. It complements Wheezy amazingly well. And it's actually, I remember seeing this box blowing up in Walt Disney World, Florida, when I went on this uh, Slinky Dog Dash coaster, I remember seeing this box there. So that is really cool to have actually like the, the intended package of this box um, actually did exist um, in the Pixar Disney World as we saw at Walt Disney World. Wheezy also comes with a certificate of authenticity. It looks like it came from Thinkway Toys. It says Toy Story 2 on it. It has John Lasseter on the bottom, the signature, so it's very OG to that time frame, 1999. So I really like this. It makes it feel official. It's like a heavy cardstock paper, um, and it's in this nice plastic protective sleeve. Um, so you won't damage it. I don't want to open it because I want to keep it in mint condition, but it's really nice that it came with a certificate of authenticity. It kind of makes it feel like you've got a signature collection Toy Story Wheezy here. That's what it really feels like. It's so amazingly well done. So Wheezy himself is a nice size. Uh, he feels really like premium in your hands. He's very, um, he's kind of a flexible plastic. So you do have some flexibility there. Um, his mouth kind of has some flexibility, which is cool. I like to see that. So it's not like super stiff that you can't move anything. And you can see there's like a, it's like a rubbery plastic material and it's perfect. I like the bottom that it's just kind of plain. There's no hole in the bottom or anything because the squeaker is in the movie in his mouth. And that's, you can totally see the speaker grill there. And this thing is really, really loud. I gotta admit, it is a really loud squeaker. So this is the squeaker. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha!
<laughs> That's really cool. If you have a dog, your dog's probably going crazy right now in this video, but it's a really loud, super loud squeaker, but I love it. It doesn't take a lot of effort to squeeze him and get that squeaking effect. Um, it's very beautifully well done, really. I, I just, Cop is the best um, Toy Story custom maker in the world. He really makes something that looks exactly film accurate replica. It looks exactly like it jumped out of the screen. I literally felt like I went to Walt Disney World and bought this or got a signature collection wheezy or, you know, it makes you feel like you got went to actual Al's Toy Barn and actually picked up a wheezy in real life. So I love the magic of this. It's just amazing to have. And I want to show a quick comparison with this wheezy and the other wheezies that I've collected over the years. So up until this point, I did have this one as my best Wheezy, which is the Disney on Ice exclusive, they call it. It was sold only in Japan. Some people say it was sold on Disney on Ice, but it's PPW. I think it's made in China, and it doesn't really squeak that well. It's a quiet squeaker. Um, but up until this point, this was the only official Disney Pixar licensed Wheezy that was closest to movie scale. Um, they definitely missed the mark because this is truer to movie scale. Um, but this was the best Wheezy for your collection, official from Disney. Um, and then a Funko Pop Wheezy, I painted the eyes to look like he has pupils on there. Um, and he has a little mic. This is a Funko Pop Wheezy, so you can see the size comparison between movie accurate, Disney on ice, and Funko Pop Wheezy. And then this is a really rare Wheezy. This is the first Wheezy I ever had. I learned that they sold this in Australia and Japan or China. And it, it was actually made to be a dog's chew toy, and it's really rare. I've only seen like two other collectors in the world find this. And he does squeak. And although he looks a little weird and not so good, um, he's the first Wheezy I ever owned in my collection. It was a hundred bucks on eBay. I remember finding him years ago. Like I got this like maybe eight years ago or more. And um, that was my first Wheezy. But it's just cool to see all the Wheezies together in <laughs> my collection. Uh, this one I paid $300 for because they're so rare and expensive. This one I paid only from Cop. It's $150 plus shipping. So closer to 200 bucks, but way worth it for movie accurate. So I actually paid less for this than, than this one. And then this was 100 bucks. And then these are pretty common. I don't know now in today's market what these Wheezies go for. But um, yeah, this we this Wheezy Funko Pop, I only paid retail price. I think it was like 14 bucks. So that was probably the cheapest one. But it's awesome and all these Wheezies look really cool together. Let me know in the comments section below, which Wheezy do you have, if you have one? There's other ones I did make, um, but these are the ones that are like more closer to movie scale, in my opinion. Now I did get a Mr. Mike. I haven't done a review on him yet, but I will in the fu near future. For now, I want you to see a size comparison between the Movie Accurate Wheezy and Mr. Mike. So you can see that he actually scales really well with Mr. Mike's microphone. And I think that's why he's more Movie Accurate scale. Because if we look at the movie, um, and there's a picture right here of that, um, he seems pretty close to the scale of what he would be with Mr. Mike. Um, I really think that Cop nailed that with the size and scaling. Um, but yeah, it's really awesome to see this. And don't worry, I will do a review on Mr. Mike soon. But it's really awesome to see these two together finally added to my collection because it looks definitely more movie accurate to my Toy Story collection. And then for fun, here is my movie accurate Woody next to my movie accurate Wheezy. And they look amazing together. I really like the size scaling of them. I think it's very true to the film. You can't get more movie accurate than this Wheezy. I really feel like they this is amazing for the collection. I just really love how they look together. Well, there you have it, my brand new movie accurate Wheezy from Cop. I really enjoyed reviewing this for you partners today. I really loved adding him to my collection. He's gonna look great for our display. I've already replaced him on my bookshelf for that old Wheezy that I had with this one. As always partners, please hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell if you haven't already so you're alerted for future videos on this channel. And I'll see you partners on the next video review. You want the real buzz like you, you're, a, no, you're an action figure. You are a sad, 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 strange little man. Sad, 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 strange little man. You are a child plaything! Hey, Ham, look, I'm Picasso! I don't get it.